All right, we got the Ibis Oso. They're in town doing demos at Marquette Mountain for the opening day. Last time I did a review on one of these, I didn't say much and I caught some serious flack from <laughs> the comment section. It's a pretty sweet setup if you can get over how ugly that chain stay is. But it's got the Bosch motor and it rides pretty, pretty sweet. So, the lifts don't allow e-bikes, so we got to pedal to the top. So, I'm going to get up there and then we'll continue this. This model has the access seat post dropper and shifting also. So, so far I've ridden the Orbea e-bike. What is it? The Orbea Rise Transition Relay The Pivot Shuttle SL The LT And this uh, Ibis Oso And I think my favorite are the shuttles The relay was really nice too But this thing also has great uh, like power delivery a good setup that's one thing you'll notice is <clears throat> the power bands are all a little different the Orbea is kind of a, a little less travel but has a good power delivery system also but I think my favorite is the pivot shuttle SL <clears throat> it's not a huge battery or a lot of newton meters of torque but it feels like a regular bike and this thing climbs like a mountain goat it's got really good traction it's got the x2 on it to just do a superior switchback I bet you that'd be yeah, more let's do that. okay yeah Oh, <clears throat> Got 
got the big 220s on here, so these brakes feel really good. Mud. Oh, that's a mess. Go for it. All right, we're doing a job on lap on this Oso e bike. First lap of the year on this bad boy. It's opening day. So Taking her chill. I normally try to hit those doubles, but these things feel a little different. Ooh. <laughs> 